Big day today, baby. Got that new turbo going in. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what's up. Got my package from ECS. Finally came, even though they sent it back the first time. But here we go. New turbo today. Alright, so the first thing we gotta do is get this tractor out of here, so we're gonna rip the tractor a little bit. Here we go. First thing we're gonna do here is drain the oil. There we go. Oh, oh. Wow. Are you fucking serious? I just like got oil everywhere and I gotta be on this floor all day. Oh. No. I know I take this heat shield off. See how long I Wow, okay, right off. I'm surprised. Covered in oil. Here we have just a wonderful ratchet. We got the ratchet. The tire iron together. Oh, it's like with this Coolant is draining, it's making a mess everywhere, but it's, it's draining, so, yeah. Alright, so we're going to remove this freaking oil line. Yeah. Uh, there's just coolant absolutely everywhere down here. When I took that line off, it just like blew up in my face. Um, yeah, so... This is going slowly but shortly. I've never done this before, so, yep. Probably gonna leak some more oil here. Even though I drained it already, there's gonna be you know, some massive amount that wants to come out anyway, because that's how today's been going. Just mix the oil and the coolant. Not going back in, so. So oil line is off, coolant line is off, oil is everywhere, coolant is everywhere. So I'm trying to remove this thing from the top of the engine and or the top of the turbo and it just like whoa. I got the hose going. Jesus. Got this whole shield off right here. All right, so I got it off and there was literally oil inside of there. All right, so it's almost out. I got pretty much everything except the three bolts that come out of the header. Um, the, so the turbo will be out shortly. All right, so this is taking like much longer than I had anticipated. I've never like swapped a turbo before, but currently I've got the oil line off. No, I've got, currently the only thing I have to do to get it out is just remove the oil feed line, which is a real pain in the balls because it's right beneath the header, but I got it loose now. So hopefully I'll have it out soon. And then I can finally start making the new one go back in. 
Um, so, yeah, I, I'm pretty close to being halfway there. So, yeah, hopefully I'll have it out in a minute. So we got the old one out. Look at that. It's like just super nasty. Um, look at the amount of play in this shaft. Like that's just awful. So, so that was definitely wrecked. This one's like very, very little, almost none. So, and now we just gotta do what we can to get them. Get this one back in.